my daughter was left for dead. The mother of a traumatized 13 year old is speaking to us about what her daughter went through. We've been following this story closely this week. Police say a girl was brutally beaten in Albuquerque as videos of the incident flew around social media and officers have arrested two young girls. We've been in close contact with the victim's family and tonight Lauren Green has how the girl's mother is describing the attack and how their family is doing. I could say it's we're OK, but we're far from OK. My daughter has endured a lot of trauma after a horrific attack on her daughter last week. The mother of a 13 year old girl brutally beaten by a group of people is speaking out. And for safety reasons, we will not be naming the mother or daughter in this story. It's disgusting that these kids are even out there doing things like this. Last week, Albuquerque police said a 13 year old girl and her friend snuck out to a house party where they got separated. Police say people took the young girl to a park and attacked her. This is the video of the incident, and we're only showing a little of it heavily blurred and muted to explain just how serious it is. People are seen beating, kicking, and even aggressively ripping the young girl's clothes off. Police arrested a 13 and 14 year old girl so far, but there's a possibility of more teens being charged. They are charged with aggravated battery and kidnapping, both of them. After the attack at a park, the mom says someone in the community greatly helped her daughter. She was screaming for help. She banged on an innocent bystander's door and realized he was outside. And this bystander helped bring her daughter to safety during the night. Her father and I would like to thank him for bringing our daughter home because if he wasn't there, he would, she wouldn't be with us. He gave her his shirt off his back, his shoes off his feet, took his dad's keys to the truck and drove her back to the friends. Seeing her afterwards in those conditions is a memory no mother wants to have. It's something I will never come back from. My daughter just walking in and seeing how beat up she was, how traumatized she was. She just kept screaming and screaming for her friend. Where's my friend? Is she okay? Is she dead? She didn't know what was going on. Her mother also told us more than a beating happened to her daughter on this horrifying night. You had to take your daughter to get a sane interview because um, she said she was raped. Yes. yes. When I showed up to the house, all she could tell me was, where's my friend? Is she safe? Is she alive? Mom, they touched me in so many wrong places. I'm sorry that they did that. Mom, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. During a SANE interview, a special exam is performed after someone is sexually assaulted to collect evidence. While the investigation continues, the mother just wants the people who did this to her daughter behind bars. They're going to do it again if they don't put them away. Lauren Green, KOB4.